Good morning, everybody. It is Thursday, and today I have remembered <laughs> that my new t recording routine is supposed to be on Thursdays, so here I am. And let's just pull this out of here. And I want to put my marker here. So I don't forget that's the middle. All right. So we are on Thursday, September 3rd. So uh, Wednesday was the last day I did. So I have a full week to do. And I do have some things I can put down. I'm always happy about that. I'm going to start pulling some of my um, magazines and maybe taking pictures out to take up some of the space. In fact, since I said that, I'm going to go find one now <laughs> and do that because they have such good things. I hope you guys didn't hear me. I'm just trying to um, find a magazine I like. Okay, here we go. Took me. Just give me time here. I'm going to use this magazine, Calm. There's all kinds of things in here. So I think. I think I can just use some of this um, for part of that. Oh, I like that. That's something I should like. I got some things I could use in journals and stuff, so I need to just kind of um, start using these. I love this. Oh, there's so much stuff. It's so. So cool. Here's a thing on how to marble paper, which that's quite a project. Ooh. Anyway, I'm just gonna put this up here and I'll grab it when I need to take care of some spaces. So back to Thursday. Um, let's look, it was a hot and humid day and I did make it till 5.15, so that's really good. It, it means I'm getting a good amount of sleep, which is important. And I had a very fulfilling morning because I, from the first two hours, from 7 a.m. till 9, I did laundry, I thoroughly cleaned my house, showered, and answered work emails. Um, so that was really great. Um, I like to have Thursdays uh, not normally Thursday, but usually on Friday, every other week I do my house cleaning. But I had a friend coming over on Friday, so I wanted to clean, get the cleaning done on Thursday. So then, um, and I recorded, of course, I talked for an, over an hour with my mother-in-law on the phone. I had two new projects at work, plus a, a fair amount of work. Um, then I made this fresh fruit salad with a honey lime dressing for a get together tonight with a sisterhood ladies. And we sold our queen bed frame. Now we just have to sell the Rainier. We're still working on that. Um, and then I left early, like 515 to go over to my friend's house in Prior Lake. And there were, I think 10 of us sisterhood ladies from my table got together and we celebrated a couple birthdays. Uh, we all brought food and we ate outside by the pool, so it was a really a good time. And I got home about 9.15 and relaxed and read before bed. So, I have a nice big section to fill and I am kinda wanna see if there's something maybe that would look nice with the fact that I went to see the ladies. So basically, I want to just kind of go through something like this. Um, a 
I like that, so I don't really want to take that out. But I can do this with these feathers. And then almost some of this kind of um, feels like it fits. And since this is a sticker page, I'm going to just pull this out. So I'm just thinking that this would be fun to like put this in here. So what I'm going to do is grab this. And I am going to just do this for my cutting. And then I'm going to tear off a little bit and just put that there. And a little bit more. Didn't quite tear off enough. Okay, there we go. I like that. So let's do that part first. Get that stuck on. Yeah, because I, I can't just keep using stickers and washi only. I really need to start using some other things. And I do have some magazines. So it doesn't hurt to just put in a little bit of that sort of thing. And that really helps take up some of that space. I really like that. And then I could probably take, I really like that pink. So maybe if I do something, the washi, I'm gonna see what I can come up with here. I woke up to a lot of work emails today, which is surprising, um, but I am glad about because I have 12 open projects right now with authors and I heard from seven of the designers, which means, um, which is great because that means there's some progress being made. So I was really glad about that. All right. I like that. It's kind of cool. And then over here, I want to use one of these stickers. Or are they stickers? Are they just cutouts? Maybe they're like a cutout. Oh no, they're a sticker. I just didn't want to act like a sticker. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do, since it's not cooperating at all, is I'm gonna put this right here. Okay. And then I can cut that off and it left just a little bit so I'm gonna just put that little bit right there and I want to put this here. Okay. All right. That's just a start. Uh, and then I'm going to put uh, this little piece over on the other side. So looks like that glue stick is done. So time to start a fresh glue stick. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna just put this right here. All right, then I can just add um, 
something to this from my pile of things that I have. So let's see what we can do. Hello, adventure awaits. Let's put this here. All right. Um, then I need something. Kind of like this, XOXO, and then um, I have an idea. Let's see, where is that? Here we go. Okay. I'm just gonna put that right there. All right, good, that's all we need there. All right, next, Friday. So Friday, um, I actually got up a little too early. I went to bed late, got up too early, so I was tired, but I had some emails, I did some reading for work, I made brownies for that evening because I was having my best friend over, and I cut, watched a couple movies on Up Faith and Family um, during my two-week trial. Then um, my friend came over at 3.20 and we had coffees and cookies and we visited and we watched the news. And then for supper, uh, we actually watched the news while we had supper. We had the Detroit pizza, which is a chicken barbecue pizza from Target and visited while we waited for Sisterhood Live to come on. They were having a special speaker. She was coming on at seven. Or was it 6.30? Oh, 7. Anyway, they had technical difficulties, and after half an hour, we just gave up. It, it's online now, and I can just go back and watch it. But we just picked a movie, uh, like a cooking romance from uh, Faith and Family, and we watched that. Um, that was fun. It was, it was fun. So, um, and then Doug went and did the grocery shopping for her and stopped to see a friend and then came home. So... I actually watched another movie after she left, and she left around nine, so I went to bed late. So I actually had a late night, uh, kind of coffeeed myself up so I could like <laughs> make it through the entire time, cause yeah. All right, so I'm going to pull this sticker off of this page because I think this color goes really nice right here with the blue in this picture. And then I'm going to put one of these circle ones up here. And gonna just put this right in here love it okay let's see and none of the things I have I got some ephemera but it doesn't go um, on this page at all boy this is loading super duper slow it's just crazy but okay all right so let's see maybe there's something else I can use in here that I would like. I like these flowers. Let's let's pull this page out. Alright. And I think these flowers would be just beautiful in here. Maybe those. So let me just do, I'm just gonna do a simple cut around these. This really makes for a pretty addition. 
So I am glad I'm finally doing this because I was kind of running out of stuff, as you guys know. So this will definitely help. <laughs> it is also lawn day here at the condos, so the mower. I, I've got all my windows open, but I had to shut my patio door, which is right behind me, uh, because it, it's a little crazy with all the noise. So I'm going to put this here. It does um, come to the bottom a little, so I'm just going to bring it up a little bit like that. And then I'm just going to cut off. Wow, that is super loud out there, isn't it? I don't know if you guys can hear it, but it is super loud because they are mowing right below my deck. <laughs> all right, oh, I like that so much. So I think to draw all this together, I could probably put something green in here maybe, because we need that green. So I think, I'm gonna go with this. So I'm just gonna put the green washi right there. Okay, I really like that. And I'm going to put the green washi as well right there. And then I just need some little thing to go here. And I really, I could just, um, I'm gonna cut some stuff off of here. Cause I see something I could do. So I'm gonna just Take this because I think it would be super cute here and just put it right here as a little thing about wildflowers because you know why not all right and I'm gonna just put that there okay just a little off center and then I have um, there's some stickers I have that are these cute little things animals and I have this little owl and I'm gonna just put them right there okay onward onward and upward the weekend so um what was it it was was friday still hot and humid um not so much actually it was we had a morning thunderstorm and then it was sunny and mild and then saturday and sunday were both nice days with temps in the 70s a little breezy really really nice days actually it's 50s now in our evenings too so I slept in, uh, we both slept in actually till 7.30. Doug made pancakes for breakfast. We watched a little HGTV. Um, Doug went out and he was actually gone for quite a while um, looking at cars because uh, we're trying to replace our Rainier with a Tahoe or a Yukon and showing our Rainier to somebody. And so um, probably Aaron's in there, I don't remember, but he was busy. I did a Zoom meeting with uh, my ladies from the church I used to go to at 10.30. And then since we were having uh, our friends, Steve and Diane, over for supper, I uh, worked on supper, grilling, the, uh, sh boiling and shredding chicken for enchiladas. So I watched some HGTV and Doug finally got home at two. He probably left at 10 o'clock. We went to Unique, which is a thrift store and a quick stop at Target. And then back home I made the flan for the dessert and then I made the green chicken enchiladas for supper. And then uh, Steve and Diane came over around six o'clock and 
we just had a super visit. They loved the food. We ate inside and then we sat out on the patio for dessert and coffee. And it was just an absolutely beautiful day and a wonderful time with our friends. So I really, I'm really glad we got to do that. And they left about eight o'clock, so we relaxed and watched a movie, um, Just Desserts, on Up Faith and Family, and read a little bit before bed. And that was about it. So I think what I'm gonna do is, I like this, so I think I'm just going to put this, and then I'm gonna find a nice sentence that I can put with that. I think that will be the best. So I'm gonna go like this, okay? And then I'm going to find a sentence that I like. I like this one. It's the little things that make life big. All right, then um, I think what I'm going to do is outline this. Okay, and then maybe put something cute up here. I have some cute things, so going to put a cow and I'm going to put a chicken and this little cute sheep. Sometimes it's just fun to do these something like that, you know. <laughs> so then over here, I'm just going to make this match right here. That's all I'm gonna do. Really simple, okay? I love this saying on here, and in these trying times, this is so true. But it says, I'm no longer accepting the things I cannot change, I'm changing the things I cannot accept. Um, I just think that's really good. So actually, this, you can do anything, but not everything. Seems to be very apt uh, words, I believe, for this. So let's just go ahead and outline that as well, okay? All right. Okay, Monday, Monday. Oh, I didn't say anything about Sunday. <laughs> oh my gosh, Terry, really. And it looks like there's just teach. Okay. Yeah, whatever. So Sunday, we got up about 6, I got up about 6.30, and Doug about 7.30, and he made cornbread for breakfast. We watched HEJTV, and then we went back to church for the first time since the lockdown in March. So six months, we have not gone physically to our church campus, um, but since we weren't having Sadie over for three weeks, um, it was fine with our daughter and her husband that we go. So, uh, and they wear masks now, so we felt comfortable. So we went to 11 o'clock service, and there weren't a ton of people there. Um, I was kind of surprised at how many people didn't wear masks. I didn't like that, but at least the people sitting around us pretty much did. And we were well-spaced where we were. Um, but it was so good to be there again, truly, just to worship and everything. And even singing in a mask, is, it's not easy, but, you know, you can do it. So we got some groceries quick at all days, and then we went home and had a very quick lunch of leftovers. And then we headed over to our friend's uh, townhouse community, and they have a beach area on a lake. So um, we had an informal get-together. We sat under the trees around a fire, 
played in the water. Everybody just did different things. I just sat uh, and visited with the ladies, basically. And we had some snacks, and it was a really good time. We were there for two hours. And then uh, we went home. Uh, I watched another movie on Faith and Family. And then at 7, we watched the movie Black Panther. Uh, ABC played it without commercials uh, just to honor Chadwick Boseman because he had died on um, Friday, I think. Yeah, on Friday from cancer. So we watched that movie that night. Monday, Monday, good weather again, 73. A little rain shower in the morning, a little sun. So Doug went back to normal work hours, which means he start, leaves a little after 7, and it, it's an hour difference. And he starts at 8 o'clock. And I'm just checking my, my emails here quick. Got to keep, keep track of that stuff. All right, so um, did that. Did some watercolor painting. Um, I had the windows and desk doors open, uh, deck door open today, actually all week. Doug got home late, like 5.30, so we watched the news, and then we made quesadillas for supper, watched a couple movies on Up Faith and Family, and read and went to bed. So this was the watercolor I was working on. I did a more detailed cactus lighter and then a darker a little bit more fluid uh, style but in the end not as fluid as I thought it was gonna be I think I was trying to do negative painting so I feel like I kind of accomplished that in a sense so that was kind of what I was going for with that one all right um, so that was that and was there any shopping did I shop on Tuesday? I must have gone to Target. Oh, see, I mixed up my days. Monday, and then the, here is Tuesday. <laughs> so I did kind of mix up my days a little bit. So actually, didn't do any shopping on Monday. All right, so um, that was Monday, so I'm just going to go ahead and put in, I have lots of space, so I think I'll just do it like this, and then I can kind of cut right about here. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay, perfect. Let's just get this on here. I'm gonna trim this a little because I want to put that there. This is about sweet peas. Um, my shower, bath, shower, body wash that I use is sweet peas. Um, I love it. It's really my favorite scent for a body wash and a body spray. Instead of perfume, I use a spray, and really, it, it's my favorite. So, um, thought it'd be kind of fun to put this here because of that, and then I can put this thing about the sweet peas down there with it, or up. Actually, I could put them up here. Must make a list. Sweet peas. Okay, there we go. All right, um, and then we just need some things to finish this page out. Liven it up with a little washi, maybe. So, we can do that. And I think I'm going to do this. Okay. And 
then I'm just going to go ahead and do one up here too. And just go like that. Okay, I like that. All right. Okay. And then I then I just need a little something a little something there to finish this out. So kind of thinking this just because of the yellow. I could just do this simple thing here. Okay, and then I just need something small um, for decor. And since I have these little things here, I think I'll just do this. And kind of like that. I'm kind of doing the white. White ones. All right, and I feel like I could have something here, but I don't know. like that. I don't really know, so that's what I'm going to do. <laughs> okay, so then I got to skip over here because I messed up my days. I do that sometimes and I wasn't paying attention. So September 1st, Doug was home part of the morning, so uh, we could do a loan for this Tahoe. And then at 8.30, the guy called the seller and said the transmission went, so the deal was off. So we either dodged a bullet or because he wanted us to pay more we um and that he just decided not to pursue it but didn't tell us that kind of what i'm thinking anyway that's what i'm thinking I'm going to answer this email. All right. Oh, good. And somebody else turned a book in. See, everybody's doing what they're supposed to, which is good. So another book, which means Eight of the 12, which is amazing. And so glad. Right before a holiday weekend. Gives the authors plenty of time to look at their book. Which is good, because they need to so crazy. I don't know why this is being weird on me. Worked fine before. Anyway, um, it's being weird. I want that to work. Okay. So, uh, Anyway, since that fell through, uh, before then, before 7, or like at 7 actually, we ran to Target. Um, I had a light work day, but we ran to Target and I got some wooden carved pumpkins for fall decorations. We picked up this little baby watermelon seedless for camping. And I also picked up these um, pumpkin. <clears throat> pumpkin Spice Breakfast Bars by Belvita, 
I don't know if you've had their breakfast bars. Um, and generally I like them. And sometimes I, you know, generally I like them because I like that type of just a plain crispy type of cookie thing. And um, so I tried it and it actually was really good. I wasn't sure, you know, but I was pleasantly surprised. So yeah, good thing. <laughs> so I thought I'd put that here and that was pumpkin spice because you know, all things pumpkin, all things pumpkin. So I think what I'm gonna do and then let's see what happened the rest of the day. I'm just putting some more of those stickers down. Okay. Um, so we had a light work day, did a lot of reading. I finished that cactus painting. Um, when Doug got home late again at 5.30, we had grilled ham steak, asparagus tips, and corn mixed together, and mashed potatoes for supper. Uh, my up week, Faith and Family, two-week trials done, so we watched an episode of Deep Space Nine, and then I watched a little HGTV and read in the evening. And I also had a sleep doctor appointment. Uh, it had been two years, and it was a virtual appointment. Um which was fine and first time I had that and it worked really well. Good virtual appointment and I don't have to do it for two years. Basically everything's good. I have some math, mask leakage so I'm gonna just um, try and take care of that but other than that um, it's fine. So then back to the third of the second day Wednesday which was yesterday um, I had a couple hours of work this morning, and I read a book. Uh, Rachel came over to show me how to assign the ISBNs for work, and then we went to do some shopping. And I got a bunch of stuff to put on the paper, because lots of ephemera. We had, um, put this back in here. Two, um, let's see, we had... We went to Blick and I got some watercolor paper. We went to Michael's and I got some flowers and fall decor. And then we went to Target and I went to Starbucks. It's the first time in two months and I bought a pumpkin spice frappuccino and I had points so I got a free pumpkin scone. And then we went, I went a little pumpkin spice crazy in Target and I bought their pumpkin spice latte the cold bottle. I bought pumpkin spice cream cheese and pumpkin spice green yogurt, some maple Oreos. I got prickly pear Tazo tea bags. What else did I get? Um, some coconut and uh, pineapple, little thing, a pint of ice cream. Um, different stuff like that. Bagels. Yeah. <laughs> All treaty type stuff. So then I watched some HGV. I actually took a short nap before Doug came home because I was tired. And we watched the news, some HGTV, some, went to look at a car, watched an episode of Star Trek Deep Space Nine, and read before bed. So nothing too exciting. daughter might come down this weekend. Anyway, so I've got, ooh, 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 so excited. Look at, I just want to put this beautiful, crunchy Starbucks bag, like right here. I love it. So I think I'm going to do this, and then I think I'm going to take this part of it. 
And I think I'm just going to do it this way. I'm just trying to figure out the way that's going to work the best. <laughs> All right. Okay, and this, um, I did get these chocolate wafers by this particular brand. Um, I do like this brand. So, what do you think I'll just put that on there too? Okay, and then let's just slip on these other things. <laughs> I'm going to put this one up here. Okay. And then put this one right here. Okay. A little different, right? But fun to do stuff like that. Okay. Oops. All right. Oh, I think it's coming along really good. Okay, so there we go. And all I need is a little bit of decor to finish up. So I think I'm going to put this heart here. And I'm going to put this little heart here, and then I'm going to put, oops, that heart I just broke, <laughs> not there. There. Kind of helps it stick a, just a little better, because, yeah, I was having a hard time sticking otherwise. And then I'm just going to put something here. Let's see, not very much. Alright, just a little sticker action going on and then we are done. So, let me just take a quick look. I did have one other thing I bought that I wanted to put in uh, Caress Soap and I didn't have a chance so um, I think I'm going to put it here because it is kind of a, a pretty, uh, it's pretty and it's light. Some caress, <laughs> caress soap. All right, so we're just going to go like that. Super easy, you guys. I'm done. Oh, and I had this one too, forgot. Because um, I got that pumpkin spice from... Um, 
what do you call it? The pumpkin spice cream cheese from Philadelphia cream cheese. And when you peel off the foil under the lid, look what you get. It's so cool. So I want to put that on there because I really like that too. And by now, I think my laundry is all done. So I'm going to put this right here. There. Oh my gosh, I'm very pleased with how everything turned out. All right, guys. So we had Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, uh, Wednesday, and a little bit of stuff there. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Oops, I'm shaking this table up. All right, bye guys.